Welcome back, everybody, to Let's Play Chrono Cross. We got reunited, and now what's going on? Show your face, Lynx. Your nine lives are up. I recognize that voice. Indeed. <laughs> Kid. Could it be? Wait, Serge. Uh-oh. Could it really be her? Oh, man, it is. Finally, we found her again. Oi, Lynx, today's the day I finish you off. What? Whoa, whoa, whoa there, Missy. Are you all right? She's quite serious. And I have a bad feeling about this. She doesn't seem to be herself. Oh, my God, look at this. <laughs> yes, she is indeed, kid. However, right now, you are the one who is Lynx. And I am Surge. Once our roles were reversed, so were our problems. To her, killing you would avenge Luca. Right, kid? Yeah, I'll put an end to Lynx today. And avenge Luca. Serge I think we better retreat for now. Give it up. We have this shack completely surrounded. There's no way you can escape. Oh no. We'll see about that. Oh, look who it is. Serge, hop on. Oh, we got away, thanks to Fargo. Damn, they got away. Heh, <laughs> anyway, this is only the beginning of everything. Wow, we haven't seen them in a while. Doesn't look like things are going too well. Good work, Polly. I'm not doing that. <laughs> I'm not screaming. <laughs> well then, Captain the others are safely on board. Good, good. And Serge is just walking off somewhere. He's had enough. No, don't jump. Aww. Hey Serge, how about you and me team up for a while? For crying out loud! We just shut up and get on with it. I'm gonna kick your ass, sorry, ass so hard to kiss the moons! Just you white links. today's gonna be the day of reckoning. Say your prayers, not that it'll do any good. Oh, he's reminiscing. Of all the times. Bad times. Good times. Oh, poor guy. I've had it up to here with you. Yeah, I know. This is the end of you, Lynx. Say your prayers. It's sad, really. How could she have not known? What has he done to her? To make her not realize that we got switched. Oh, Serge. Hey, we haven't seen you in a while. Tell me, what is the most important thing in your life? Ask yourself what you can do and what you need to do in order to attain it. If not you, then whom? If not now, then when? Right, Serge? Hmm... I guess you're right. Still must be hard though. Okay, we're on the boat. And you can't really leave just yet because Fargo really wants to talk to you, so... Viper, let's settle this old score once and for all! Prepare yourself! How did he get here on the ship? <laughs> Is that you, Serge? Fargo, I'll do will have to wait. I need to have a talk with Serge. Ugh, have it your way. <laughs> Serge, Lynx is headed to the Sea of Eden. We must do everything in our power to prevent him from obtaining the frozen flame. I shall lend a hand. We must put a stop to him. Well, I guess the old man is perked right up because he joins us. All right. I like that idea. Arg, what the hell? Aye, Serge, I'll help you out too. You saved me life twice already. And I guess I already know too much. I can't just sit around and ignore the situation. 
You got that right. Fargo. Hooray. Fargo is very important from now on. He's gonna, we're going to be seeing a lot of him. Very important to get him. Viper, I'll deal with you later. Once we put an end to this situation, you're mine. Very well. I will not run from you. I'll be happy to accept your challenge. Wait! <laughs> oh no! We're coming too! I hope that's okay with you, Serge. Oh sure, I, you know... Marcy, like, joined your party! Oh my god, this is craziness! <laughs> and guess who else? Ha! There ain't no way I'm backing out of this! And since you saved Lady Riddell, I've decided to help you out. Please, just a thank you will be enough. All right, Bishy McSephiroth, I guess it was inevitable. Karsh. Everybody's joining. It's a party. Shall we be on our way, Serge? And then I think, yeah, whoa, look at all those people we have now. They give you a chance to um, switch. I'm not going to do it just this moment, but we will soon. So hold tight. And they automatically, we're going to go to the entrance of the Dead Sea, and we all remember that. Now remember, this this is the entrance to the Dead Sea. We've actually never really been in this one, I don't believe. We went to the one in the other world. Do you guys remember that? Hey. What are you doing here? Do you know how to get through here? You wish to know? This place is called the Pearly Gates. This used to be the only entrance to the Sea of Eden. However, legend says no one has been able to see it or approach it ever since these dragons sealed the evil flame. Then how are we supposed to get in? You need the powers of the dragons that sealed the flame. You must break the seal of the pearly gates with relics from each of these six dragons. Relics? Break the seal? You mean here? <laughs> None. The true gate to the Sea of Eden is not here. It is in the other world where the Dead Sea lies. So where are we supposed to find the six dragons? You will find them scattered around both worlds. They will be easy to find with all the legends about dragons throughout the islands. Oh, and Monster Lynx. The other Monster Lynx disguised as Surge is already in here. That is because his appearance is that of Surge. What do you mean? Even if you are able to get all six dragon relics, you will not be able to make it inside as Monster Lynx. Then what are we supposed to do? The dragon tear. That is all I can tell you. Now, it is my turn to ask one question. Monsieur Lynx, if you had to choose between the world or moi, which would you choose? I'm pretty sure this answer doesn't matter. I I hate answering this. It always seems so sad. I don't know. I, I, I like Harley, but I think the world might be a little more important. I'm sorry. <laughs> oh, she looks disappointed. Poor girl. Yeah, I'm pretty sure it doesn't matter whichever one you choose. It's gonna be the same outcome, I believe. Hey, we're on a motherfucking boat. You go, sea dog! Go and find yourself! I wish you well. Oh my god, are all these accents getting to everybody? <laughs> I don't even know how I'm keeping up. Holy moly. And another scene. Why must I have to tell him such things? You are such an idiot, Harley. Hey, <laughs> what's wrong, Harley? There's fluid coming out of your eyes. Oh, it's you, Starkey. It's nothing. Don't worry about it. Something is different. Starkey can tell. Harley's makeup doesn't look the same today. Starkey doesn't think it's nothing like you say. Why'd you lie to me, Harley? Dear God, okay, okay. I guess I cannot fool you. Listen, Starkey, this is called a tear. It's something that flows from your eyes natural moment when you are sad, when you got hurt. Tear to cry? So water comes out of your eyes when you are sad? Are you so sad you can wash your face with tear? <laughs> Oh, go to sleep, Starkey. 
And don't tell anyone I was crying. You promise not to, you will not tell? Starkey like promises. Starkey will promise not to tell anyone that Harley was crying. Wait a minute, crying means that Harley is sad. But why? Even though we are close, I cannot tell you that. You will find out eventually, Starkey, if that time comes. Every problem has a solution, I hope. Ah. Uh, well, when we come back, let's go uh, see what we can do. We gotta go find ourselves. This is actually a really cool part in the game because we have a lot of uh, fun stuff coming up. Alright, see you later guys.